Hey guys, welcome to the show. I'm Patrick and on this episode, I am feeling summery. I've got five ice creams and lollies which will definitely make you feel even more summery. You know what time it is. Hello guys and welcome to Way in Time. I'm Patrick and on this episode the sun has got his hat on finally. So well it's it's warm sort of today. It's a bit windy. Okay you need a coat when you go outside but there is sun and to get you ready for the summer months, weeks, summer hours maybe this year um, I'm going to be going through my top five low sin lollies and ice creams but it is the Sunday weigh in so make sure you drop your gains, your losses, your tips and your tricks in the comment section below and as always if you're not doing so already make sure you drink some water you need at least 2.5 liters of water every day it is almost summer and there is nothing better than on a hot sticky day enjoying a cold sticky ice cream so these five kind of lollies and ice creams will actually hit that spot and also they're low in sin so they're not going to make you feel too bad as well so my first lolly on on this list, the first lolly on my list, I've mentioned them before, are these, the Round Trees Fruit Pastel Lollies. These are just two and a half sins per lolly. Um, they're really nice, really tasty. There are another variety available as well, which are like smaller round ones. Um, I personally prefer these. These definitely last a lot longer than the new ones, and they're only two and a half sins. And what's more, um, for these lollies, they're not gonna cost you much lolly. <laughs> Yeah, they're only a pound, that's why. And size comparison to my head, as always, there's the lolly. It's not too bad, actually. It's quite a nice size, and it's pure kind of ice lolliness inside, so it is gonna take you quite a long time to actually eat it. And for two and a half sins, these are incredibly good value, and you get a lot of them. And my second lolly on the list is these, these are the uh, Solo Smoothie Lollies from Iceland. They're only at the moment, I believe, £1.50 for a box, which I think is pretty good value. You get six mango smoothies and six raspberry smoothies. There's also a couple of other um, Solo ice creams and ice lollies and stuff on there. Uh, they're all around about the two and a half sins, which is what these are. Now, they're not quite as big, I don't think, as the Round Trees ones, but they're more kind of ice creamy, um, so they are quite nice nice and I think these are pretty good and for uh, £1.50 for a box I think that these will definitely be a slow sin uh, treat on a summer's day. Coming in at number three and four on my list are these. These are the Max Twister Minis. We've got uh, pineapple, strawberry, and lemon and lime. And then we've also got blackcurrant and also strawberry and vanilla flavors. These are currently on offer in Asda for two for three pounds, which I thought was pretty good. And they are this size. Uh, so they are nice little earrings actually, maybe Christmas earrings, LV earrings, something like that. Um, these are pretty good. Uh, what I would say with these is that they are quite creamy. So they're a little bit like um, a strawberry and ice cream together. So they do actually taste really nice. There are only two sins per lolly. So you could have a couple of these, which will definitely hit the sweet tooth. And also it will cool you down on those summer days. So they're really nice, really tasty, and I strongly recommend getting them. However, I still think that for two and a half sins, the round trees fruit pasta lollies, which I mentioned earlier, probably will last you a little bit longer than this one. Before I get to number five on my list, I actually wanted to mention something which isn't actually here, uh, but I have mentioned it on another video before. And because it's like ice creams and lollies and all that kind of stuff, it definitely is worth a mention. Uh, there is an ice cream which I've mentioned in a dessert video previously called Oppo ice cream. Now it is like a traditional ice you know like Cornish ice cream, like the good creamy stuff? Um, it is like that, 
and it tastes really nice, but it's actually kind of lower in calorie, and as a result, it's lower in sin as well. So for 100 grams of Oppo ice cream, I believe it was four or four and a half sins, which I think was personally well worth it. And you can get it in co-op, and you can get it in uh, little, like kind of Waitrose stores. It is relatively expensive, like I said, um, but you can get 50, pen uh, 50 pence off per pot when you uh, go onto the Oppo website. So it's O-P-P-O. -P -P -O. So check it out. It's worth checking out for the summer. And number five on my list are these. I've saw these for the first time today and I was like, right, I'm gonna get them. Um, now it's Solo Stuff, which is in Iceland. I've never really heard of it before, but when I was in there today, they've got quite a few things. So I chose like two of like the, the, the biggest variety, but there are quite a lot of them and they're actually quite low in sin as well. So that's pretty good. Uh, but these are the four Solo Sundays. They're 102 calories per Sunday and they're available in mango, lemon and lime, passion fruit and pineapple. And this is what they look like. Oh, they're really cute, aren't they? These are five sins though, but they are quite a lot of ice cream in there, so that's pretty good, all kind of like sorbet-ish sort of stuff. This is the pineapple one, um, and I, is, I think I've reached this part of my life now where I start looking at things like, oh, what can I do with it afterwards? Because this is a tiny pot. So I was thinking, once I've done it, I could stick it in the dishwasher and maybe put some, like, uh, some peanuts in there or something like that, you know? So it's, it's multitasking, it's good value. So have a little look. They're only about £1.50 at the moment in Iceland. They're well worth it. So these are the four solo Sundays from Iceland at Five Sins. Thank you guys for watching this episode. Don't forget the Sunday weigh-in is open, so make sure you drop your gains, your losses, your tips, your tricks, and anything that you want to say into the comment section below. And also don't forget to go on weighintime.com. There's a massive community there, and it would be really nice to hear from you. I'll be back again on Wednesday, so make sure that you subscribe, please do. It means so much to me, and you'd be really helping me out, so thank you very much much. Have an amazing morning, afternoon or evening whenever you're watching this and I will catch you next time on another Way In Time. I'll see you then. I wasn't expecting it to be so melted. Mmm. Mmm. Two and a half sins well spent. Right, I'm going to have to put some of these back because they're melting. Mm.